whole story. Um, we have a new product, and we got several thousand of these in, and they're going to sell out in a few days. The rate we're selling them. I want to thank the listeners for getting it, but this really is a game-changing tool. And it doesn't compete with Super Dean that's fortified with oil, silver, and iodine and fluoride three. The adult or the children's. These are both excellent toothpaste, concentrates that don't have fillers. People love it. This is a rectal toothpaste that also has the above sea coral calcium that also cleans but also remineralizes the teeth. Then it has the patented silver salt, silver in it to knock out the bacteria that cause gingivitis. Everyone has a toothpaste this good for knocking out the bacteria, the viruses, uh, and cleaning the teeth in a healthy way strip away the enamel. So we're really proud of it. It's on here on InfoWarsStore.com. That's why we're still on it. There's a famous quote by a Marine Corps general in the Korean War. And three million shy comms had flooded across the border and surrounded the Marines. More than 50 to 1, some estimates have it. But the point is they were outnumbered and the general was told, General, we're close around. He said, good. In all directions. That's the point that InfoWars has reached. And it really is epic. It really is biblical. It wouldn't have gone this far without all your support. But it's going to become more critical than ever as the censorship becomes complete. And it's not just Americans, but folks all over the world are completely silenced when it comes to speaking the name of a CIA fake whistleblower or exposing a pedophile or speaking out against dangerous vaccines. Because by InfoWars having its own platform, that separates the globalists. You're listening to The Alex Jones Show. Live from London, England, it's Paul Joseph Watson with Summit.News. Mainstream left wing publications are admitting that it is swinging entire elections now in America. They can say that it's a good thing, that's perfectly fine. If you say it might be a negative thing, if it's a conservative candidate, then you're a horrible racist white supremacist. Over in Europe, you have this story out of Brighton.